Combating anti-Semitism and Holocaust denial and distortion is a priority for me personally as a U.S. ambassador. It is also a heartfelt priority for President Biden, a man with a long history of friendship with Israel and the Jewish community. So I'm grateful for the opportunity to join you on this day of remembrance. For those of us who are assembled today, diplomats and public servants, Today is the day to take stock and ask, are we closer this year to the world that understands the ramifications of the Holocaust? With every year, the events of the Holocaust can, for younger generations, be more and more remote, with fewer voices of survivors. At the same time, there are those who are disgusting who manipulate our memories and data to spread disinformation for their own despicable ends, deny or destroy the enormity of the Holocaust, which murdered six million individual Jewish men, women, children, friends, mothers, fathers, daughters, sons, loved ones, all human beings. It remains our responsibility as leaders to educate our young people to confront the lies and hatred and to ensure that the future generations do not shy away from these painful truths. Sadly, we must confront the fact there is an alarming rise in anti-Semitism around the world, which has also manifests itself in our own community. So let me use this occasion to recommit to work together for a world that always remembers the Holocaust. So the future generations will continue to say, never again. Thank you.